welcome all welcome to this new video where we are going to discuss the top 5 piping courses the first one is piping elements in this course we are going to discuss what is piping what is piping engineering what are various disciplines what are various deliverables how other discipline interface with the piping how process interface is there process is a very important part so that's why we have covered in detail then various elements like pipe flanges valves strainers steam traps everything is uh, all the types have been discussed what are various application how each and everything is different from other types so all those things have been covered in first part which is piping elements then second one is codes and standard here we have covered all the asme codes and standards various important clauses from api and ASTME standards in api we have covered api 600 60 598 so many other clauses we have already covered how each and every uh, standard is different from each other ASTM standard we have covered many material uh, standards more than 20 grade 20 grades we have covered we have covered in such a way so that we can understand each and every ASTM in a similar manner impact testing here all the clauses to get the exemption from impact testing have been covered okay important clauses from ASME also taken to get the exemption so all those things have been discussed in detail in pipe thickness we have covered uh, right from basics like stress strain curve pt rating allowable stresses what are various clauses in asme codes then all the elements which are important to calculate the pipe thickness cal okay all those things have been covered in detail in plot plan we have covered right from starting what are the various inputs required to start the development of any plot plan various stages which a plot plan go through throughout the life, cy life cycle of the project then guidelines for various equipment okay this is very detailed one each and every equipment is discussed in detail all the various guidelines which are important uh, while developing the plot plan have, have been covered then isometric management this is very important this is very uh, last phase of the project but very tough one because so many stakeholders are involved there we, need, we are going to cover what is isometric tracker what are the various stages which isometric go through various excel tricks okay if you don't know uh, excel we have covered uh, how to make pivot pivot tables slicers how to interlate each other so so many things we have covered here extraction of reports okay once we know this we can extract so many reports very easily hold management there are so many holds while extracting while issuing the isometric so how to cover those things how to extract reports related to holds how to present it to management so all those things have been covered then how to publish status reports daily status weekly status monthly status how we can get it automatically so all those things have been covered in this part layout concepts so every piping engineer has to know all the concepts related to layout we have covered all the piping layout design criteria for compressors pipe rack pumps columns heat exchanger each and every section is discussed in detail we have discussed what are the various drives related to call compressors okay what are the various associated items if steam turbine is there how to decide the elevation all those aspects have been covered in detail okay in pipe rack what are the various uh, things we need to start with pipe rack battery limit configurations interconnection diagram okay how to calculate the number of tiers piping how to do the basic supporting everything has been covered here in pump section also again all the suction discharge piping elements how to do supporting how to do uh, different uh, pumps layout and piping everything is discussed in detail in columns also we have to uh, do nozzle orientation in most of the cases so those things are co covered in detail heat exchanger various type of heat exchanger we have taken then operational and maintenance aspects we have covered for all the items so all those things have been covered in detail so this is how we are going to cover uh, piping engineering aspects in all these five uh, courses so i'm sure you are going to like this and uh, you can get uh, various discounts while enrolling the course uh, the links have been given in the description box so don't forget to give your feedback rating on each and every course and uh, also mention in comments what other things you want me to cover so see you in the next part